Hello everyone, this is Cam and welcome to another VOTB video and today we're covering the dream car competition picture. So before we get started guys, make sure don't forget to give us some thumbs up if you like this video, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and consider joining the Patreons guys, link in the description below. Membership starts from only £3 per month and you can get access to the VIP WhatsApp and the Facebook group. The most recommended membership is the silver membership, as you can see, it starts from uh, 4 dollars uh, and you can get access to that giveaway that I'm doing. As you guys know, I'm giving away £20 every single week to play BOTB. So you can get one entry on that one. If you go for the gold membership, you can get uh, two entries. Platinum gives you five entries and the VIP gives you ten entries. Okay, right. So I have got Dean with me today. How's it going, Dean? Evening, Cam. Yeah, not too bad, buddy. Not too bad. I need to put my headphone on. I thought no one joined in today, so give me two seconds. Oh. Left, right. Okay, correct. There you go. Can you hear me now? Yeah, I could hear you. Yeah, yeah I'm all good, buddy. Thank you. Brilliant, brilliant, brilliant. Before I used to do the uh, live streaming with that, that Mac, iMac there, so that had a built-in speaker. So I've got a gaming PC now. You guys probably saw it on the YouTube short that I've done. Uh, so that obviously hasn't got a speaker. So I'm going to i have ordered one. It should come sh uh, shortly. Right. So let's go through some comments very quickly. A lot of people join. That's amazing. Smash that like button, guys. It's absolutely free. It doesn't cost you anything. Okay. Alan just showed. How's it going? Alan, hope you're good. Saying evening. Busy working tonight. Here's my coordinate. Not too bad, Alan. Thank you so much for submitting your coordinate. Next one we got from Canoe. How's it going? Yes, smash that like button, guys. Chatting is saying hi, Cam. Thank you for doing another video. In case I can't tune in later, here's my winning code. Net there, no problem. I'll take that in a minute. How's it going, Abdi Hakim? Hope you're good. Uh, hi, uh, is it game? Gazm uh, saying I'm uh, playing BOTB, but I still uh, like watching Cam's video. Thank you so much, bro. Thank you so much, guys. Uh, uh, thanks for liking these videos and make sure hope you're subscribed and smash that like button. Uh, Turkey just trying to saying, put the cigarette out, Cam. You're late. <laughs> Hope you're over. Yeah, just I was just having the last cigarette just before I do actually. Uh, so yeah, yeah, not too bad, bro. How's it going? Uh, hi, Suruj. Hope you're good. Say hi, Cam. Hope you're doing well. Not too bad. Hi, Hash. How's it going? Hi, Raman. Hope you're good. So, how's it going? Asama. Hope you're good. Hi, Mo Disco. Saying hi, Cam. Hope you're well, bro. Not too bad. Hi, Connie. How's it going? Hi, uh. Ab Abduas Ardu, hope you're good. Hi Mo, uh, Lee, how's it going? St. Cam Dean, how is the weekend going? It is good, going amazing. Uh, uh, saw quite a few cars and everything, so I'm very happy. Very happy. <laughs> right, okay, let's go ahead and have a look at this week's picture then. Obviously, I've done a live stream about this already. So uh, if anyone got the average coordinate from the last live stream, just submit it in the comment section below. I don't know why I'm logged out from this. Probably it's new one. Uh, so new computer, obviously. So I probably didn't play BOTB from this. I actually wanted to because I've got a very high-risk uh, monitor, 165 hertz display, 4K monitor. So I'll probably see those uh, coordinates a little bit better than the the iMac right mm -hmm. okay so i played um 20 tickets sorry dean played for the rs7 rs6 sorry so i said i told you remember last time so it's probably the weekend is going to be for the rs6 they might keep that uh tomorrow as well as i have a strong feeling but mm -hmm. they might just change it to if it's a gtr then there you go dean you got probably you know a few tickets today and a few tomorrow so I'm yeah. going to show you uh, where I went and everything uh, quickly, and then you guys will be able to see it. Uh, that's where I went, actually. That's my free ticket right there, and then the top cluster, that's where I went. Uh, I st I'm still thinking it might just be, a lot of you probably going to say that it's a bit too high, but I still think it's even higher than that. But that's the lowest I could go, and that's where I went. So let's see if it gets crushed. Mm. What about you, Dean? How many tickets you played this week? I'm not going mad. There's too many crazy eyes in one picture. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's quite hard because obviously you've got the in the far left, you've got two players that are up in the air. Okay. Well, I don't know if they, they're they jumping up to header it or they've headed it already. And obviously it's going from left to right as you look at it. Yeah, yeah, you've, yeah. Got, you've got the goalkeeper that looks like he's stoned and he's looking straight up. Yeah. And then obviously you've got the player just on the left, as you look at the picture, just on the left. He's looking up at an angle. Yeah. Then the, then the guy in the middle is kind of looking straight up or a bit tad to the right as you look at the picture then the guy on the right is kind of looking high and left high but and left 
I I don't know if it's just me or what I'm getting old. My eyes are going funny, but it looks like it's been quite bad Photoshop because I think the book the ball looks above the crossbar. Yeah, if you actually go in line with the bloke in the middle with his his head. Yeah, uh, yeah, just a tad to the left and then up a bit. Yeah, yeah, it's there now. If you take the magnifying glass off, it looks like the like the outline. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. True. Yeah, I mean, it could be that, it could be something else. But the thing is, obviously, even the ball was there. The yeah. judges, there's no guarantee yeah. the judges are going to go there. So we should stick to our uh, normal um, tactic and everything and just do our, play our normal game. Yes, yeah. that doesn't, that never helped. That did never, that never helped really. And we're not in that stage where you don't know how to play this game and you just have to find those areas. So, I mean, we know uh, very well, and you've been playing for a long time, Dean. So, obviously, you've got an idea how this is and how this works and all of that. So, yeah. anyway, Rubo Rana, after a long time, just won that PS5 of me and then you disappear. That's not fair, is it? Okay, so how are you doing, bro? Hope you're good. Okay, uh, how's it going? Is it Vole? Hope you're good, saying you will probably be able to see the soul of the coordinate with that monitor. <laughs> Hopefully. Hopefully. Uh and for, I didn't play anything yet, though. Do you know, what I mean, every time, every time I'm in, especially when I, um, uh, when I uh, do my car thing, obviously I take my laptop with me and all of that. So I normally play on that, but I didn't get time to play in here. But anyway, yeah, we'll do. Probably put a few more tickets. They put a different car tomorrow, so I'll probably give it a go and put more tickets in here. Right. So let's start with drawing some lines. Obviously, we did that already. We went through this, uh, you know, already. Uh, on uh, was it on on Tuesday? I think that's where I went. So in this kind of picture, normally the history says the judges uh, normally go straight up from one of their eyes, which could be that. So that's one option. And otherwise, obviously you can literally go in the middle. Now I understand he's not looking straight up. That's why from the left, the left line you can see I'm I'm just going a tiny bit to the left. I mean to the right, but it's not going to be too much to the right. That's what I think. Like Dean said, from the goalkeeper, he is kind of looking quite up, probably up as in that much up or higher. Um, funny enough, because the, he is quite far back. So now, if the ball was um, not that high, he wouldn't be looking that high. So if he's looking that high, that means the ball should be really high. Now, uh, even that guy here, if you line up, it looks like it's looking quite high, like crazy high, like that high. Now, from this guy here, that... Uh, made me go slightly lower, like as low as this. So that's the problem here. It's it's, it's very hard to uh, guess the height. Now, what you can do on this kind of situation situation is basically if you can get the X right, which is say for example, if it's that or in middle of them two coordinate, you can just literally draw a line. For example, keep going higher uh, and cover a lot of uh, area. I'm just giving you an example. I'm not saying do that exactly or anything, but, you know, you can do that. And that was a uh, kind of picture that, well, that's not the same picture, but uh, this kind of scenario when Darren uh, won, basically what he did, he did two or three lines like that. And he literally went straight up from uh, whatever player, uh, whatever the picture uh, he had, like he was, he was not very sure about the height. And then he went like this, like with three lines and then he won like that so um yeah so if you are confused about the height and if you are 100 percent sure about the x you can do that now same pattern you can do a bit of angle i went straight up it might just be if they are going straight up then it makes sense if not then you can do a bit of angle for example like this draw I mean? so uh, this kind of angle and it can just literally go like in that direction and everything so yeah it could be anyway obviously this is not an easy game and you if you win you're gonna win over a hundred thousand pound worth of price obviously that this thing is not gonna be easy that's common sense it's not gonna be easy it cannot be easy because there's so many play players who's playing this uh game botb and obviously everyone's trying to win and that's gonna be only one winner so that makes it uh almost impossible i'm not gonna say it's impossible but it's that hard it's just one step you know away from being impossible so it's that hard basically next to impossible anyway but still never lose hope guys you never know 
you know anything can happen and you might just get lucky and you might just win because you know last week's winner that cypher guy he's actually from luton and he's my cousin's uh friend like there's their classmates from school like they went to same school and everything so do you know what I mean? It is happening. It is happening around us. We all know it's all genuine and all everything, but it's just that it's being harder and harder to win every day, day by day. So, so uh, that's the uh, problem with this game is because obviously BOTB, uh, they are massively advertising uh, and obviously they are getting a lot of new players every single day. And it's the more players you get, your chance of winning going to be less. It is less as it is anyway. But obviously the skill... Uh, in this game, is obviously based on probably 30% skill and 70% luck at the moment, based on the current uh, the amount of player who plays BOTV. Anyway, so let's start taking coordinate then from you guys. So, uh, first ever coordinate was submitted by submitted by uh, is it Alan? Alan's coordinate. There you go. He always does uh, submit the first coordinate. So, let me just adjust my mic a little bit. Okay, there you go. So Ireland's coordinate is 2446 1419. So you're feeling lucky this week, Dean, or what do you think? Yeah, uh, not really with this one. I'm not going to hold my breath on this one. I've, I've, I think I'll be probably, hopefully, be better off on the midweek one. Yeah, yeah. Is it the one that the guy literally holding the balls? Yeah, that one, yeah. Do, okay. Doing the Vinnie Jones. Yeah, so basically. He that's the perfect example of a game called spot the ball, basically. Spot the balls. <laughs> you know what I mean? Mm. Okay. Yeah, I'm not feeling lucky. I don't know why. I, I don't to be honest, I'm not I, I don't I didn't find this picture too hard. Uh, mm. but I, I'm not feeling lucky. I mean I I just can I can feel it, it's not happening. It's yeah. not happening with me at least. That's what I can feel. So that's why I'm not I'm not spending uh, too much on this, even though I did spend quite a lot actually already. Spent about, bought about twenty tickets, and that's like nearly fifty pounds. So mm -hmm. that's what I spent on this, including that thing. You know that slider is a killer, man. Do you know what I mean the ticket price was like one seventy, and then the slider adds one pound thirteen per ticket. So that's mm -hmm. like nearly the price of that, the price of the actual price. So I think mm -hmm. BOTB, if they're watching it. I understand, obviously, bringing that promotion and everything, but I think you should be OTB. You should put that price down a little bit because uh, we used to get that 50k with the car free. I understand the ticket price was slightly expensive, but it actually works out way more expensive than before it used to be before. So if you could put that 50k p p uh, slider, probably 80p, 90p or something, that would actually attract a lot of people to go to the max and uh, buy more tickets. End of the day, it's more business for you and there's going to be more people uh, buying tickets uh, as well and they'll be paying more money. So if you could reduce that, that would be amazing. I'm sure someone watching from BOTV, they always do anyway, but uh, you know, if you're watching this, you should suggest it to people who take those decisions uh you know explain to them that uh that's what you know uh, as just a suggestion for me okay right uh next one from raman which is uh, 2558 uh just to let you know guys it's going to be a short video it's not going to be a very long video tonight because i'm i have started a bit late and i know dean has got work and everything so uh you know it's uh, it's going to be not going to be a very, very long video. We are trying to get back to the longer ones, uh, which obviously I understand you guys enjoy. And I do enjoy as well, to be honest. It's just that I've been running around with cars all day and everything. I get do get tired and uh, it's, it's hard for me to come live. I actually can. But the thing is, I don't want to come live and look like I'm exhausted, can't be asked to talk. And everything i need to i want that energy as in uh, to talk and everything so that's that's why you know rather than a bad live stream i just want a good live stream but you know even though if it's you know uh, not very often okay right next one do you see that video it broke my tv man Kind of a bit of sweet thing though, isn't it? You broke you, your boy broke it, but then you got a better one. <laughs> no, I was I was actually happy. I was I was so happy because I was uh, asked my wife, should I get a new TV? Because our one we had it for like I don't know, probably five six years, and uh, it's it was a fifty inch, 
So now, obviously, everyone's got 65 and 75s and all of that. So I thought, let me just get a 4K 765-inch TV. So once <laughs> he told me, a video called me, a proper uh, thing, um, what's he called, um, upset and everything, like he was feeling guilty. And uh, I was actually happy that, yes, you did it. Well done. So I get to buy a new TV now. <laughs> It's on the shorts, guys, if you guys want to watch it. I'm doing a lot of shorts nowadays. Uh, it looks like it's quite a popular thing to do. So, uh, yeah, I'll be posting uh, short videos every now and then. So stay tuned for that, guys, and make sure you watch those and give us some thumbs up. It really helps, guys. And even on this video, guys, if you like this video, what happens is YouTube suggests this video to those people that probably play BOTB and they don't know about this channel. So uh, it suggests these videos to a lot of people. So if you could do that, that would be amazing. I can only make 10, 15 different ideas and like my own videos, but I can't do so many. So uh, you guys have to help on that. <laughs> Joking. Right. Uh, 25, 30, 12, 60, 72. Yeah, with this picture, it's definitely a corner. So I'm, I'm thinking if it's coming from the right, as you look at the picture, or... What do, you, what do you think about these two guys, though? Yeah, they that's like, what I mean. They look like they're engaging with the ball, isn't it? Yeah, this is what I mean. I think that I don't know if they're jumping up or they, they're just coming down from... Because obviously the guy the guys in the black kit are yeah. the, def the defenders. And obviously the guy in the blue, well, yeah. two of the guys are in the blue. They're obviously attackers. So yeah. I don't know if it's coming in from across and... He, Coming in from across from the right to left as you look at it, yeah, or the defender in the black top is headed it away, so they're looking that way. So the yeah. people, the people in the middle, yeah. are just spectators. They're just watching the ball pass and not actually going to get it. Yeah, true. Ant Man, how's it going, bro? Hope you're good. Anthony, oh. Ant Man, Ant Man. Ant -Man. <laughs> I don't know if he's a Marvel fan or a DC fan, but Ant-Man. You got hiccups? Yeah. You need to drink water. Go and drink water. Yeah. <laughs> How's it going, guys? Hope you're good. Hi, right, guys. Um, saying what TV you got, Cam? Uh, I haven't got a TV yet. I can't get one. That's the thing. Uh, I don't want to spend so much on a TV, if you know what I mean. I can, obviously, if I, if I buy, say, for example, a 75-inch, um, because, you know, the distance between the TV and the sofas is not that much. So, obviously, it's going to hurt you, hurt my eyes, basically, if I watch a movie and stuff like that. So, I will stick to 65, but I'm trying to buy a OLED TV. So... They're quite expensive, by the way, but still, um, you know, not too bad. I mean, the, the, the quality is very good. Imagine that, you know, you got a phone about that size. And just because of that OLED display, there's so much, like a, a thousand pounds just for that. Imagine with that screen, a 65-inch TV. So it's quite expensive. The cheapest one I found from LG was like 1500 Uh, But uh, there was, a, like, if you go for Sony and everything, you know, the proper, like, good... Uh, hers tv they're like three and a half grand four grand and everything but a normal 65 inch 4k they uh i saw it on argos they're going for like 500 500 600 you can pick one up but i just wanted to buy an oled so that I, I can have it for a long time if i buy a cheap one the next year i'll think like oh let me change it you know what i mean yeah all right michael how's it going michael hope you're good Saying, evening everyone is it even worth winning a diesel or petrol car now i'm only playing for the electric cars on offers often now um yeah diesel petrol doesn't matter i mean obviously if you want to go for the car obviously the new diesels are u less free if you live in london or something so it's okay i mean new diesels are euro six uh, u, u less free and all of that so it doesn't matter what car is or whatever you prefer if you'd like to save a little bit of fuel go for a diesel i mean if you do a lot of motorway journey and all of that so you know it's better but if you think now nah, i'm not going to drive it much and everything then go for a petrol uh, petrol cars are good, but diesel cars are also not too bad. But if you don't drive it, don't go for a diesel because so many problems will start and everything. 
if you don't drive them, the turbo goes, the DPF gets blocked, and so many issues with the diesel cars if you don't drive them. But if you drive them every day, then yes, go for a diesel. And even electric, electric problem is this country is still not actually designed for the electric cars. If you're in America, you'll see every service station. If you live in London, yes, you'll see a lot of uh, charging station and everything. But in here, uh, even though they've got it in the service stations and in the major towns, but it's not that much as uh, they have it in America and everything. So I would say probably after five years, uh, electric cars going to be a very common thing. There's going to be so many charges, uh, uh, charging points, and everything. And you know you can go for it. Don't do that, please. You need to be quiet if you want to stay here. Sorry, guys. Okay. Uh, all right. Next one. Uh, guys, saying that is uh, my uh, that is near my single ticket. Did I take guys' coordinate? I didn't. Okay. Let me just quickly take that, which is twenty five sixty. Twenty five sixty. Uh, 12 25 about that area, yeah. Okay, no problem. Next one, Dave. How's it going, Dave? Hope you're good. Okay, good evening to you. Uh, his coordinate is 26 uh, 61 21. 11. I mean, uh, 1273. 20 to 21 sorry i actually do the right thing i got it 21 <laughs> in my mind but i say it's 62 i don't know why i say that Drunk, too many so. counting for today that's why yeah too much counting in it <laughs> <laughs> yeah yeah to count a lot of money today so yeah uh kev how's it going kev after a long 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 time hope you're good have you been close after you had the master winning coordinates since then have you been running up so many times? I, I saw you sharing some photos being runner up and everything. So good luck, buddy. Hope you're going to win uh, one day soon. So, uh, yeah, <clears throat> his corner is 2506, 1289. Uh, okay, about there. My man Hitler, how's it going? Okay, right. <clears throat> 2577. Need somebody to get Churchill picture on now. <laughs> yeah. Because scissors beats paper. <laughs> Neil, how's it going? Hope you're good. Uh, what's the Cam? What's the TV budget? To be honest, I wanted the. I really want that three and a half grand one, but I don't want to spend that much. So, budget at the moment about sixteen hundred, half of it. She get a projector. Up. What about a projector, Cam? Nah, you, you, you projector never get. On the wall. I know that nowadays it can get some decent projectors, like even 4K ones. But you know the OLED screen, those crystal clear ones, mm. they are something else, man. I went to John Lewis the other day. I was doing shopping because uh, you know bought some gift for my uh, uncle and auntie from because you get all the designers in one place in it so they uh they had a tv and i saw it like so nice man the price was like four and a half grand it was sony's uh one of the best tv that was like this that was only um 48 inch not even that big but it's us it was up for four and a half grand but you know the quality oh my god i mean i was standing about that close to the tv and you can see it crystal crystal clear so i mean every single pixel like so bright so nice so it and everything you know on a on a, even on a high res tv if you watch it from very close you can see it's not that clear when you watch it from far it looks okay but that was amazing man anyway too much discussion about tv i don't know why but yeah <laughs> it was because it was on my mind all day i've been looking for one uh online that's why probably well, i took michael's corner already all right next one mr oshamari saying hi cam uh hope you're doing all right bro my corner is that How's it going, Al Shamari? Hope you're good. Hope you smash that like button. Make sure you guys do, whoever's watching. Okay, if you are not subscribed and just watching this live stream, guys, obviously, as you can see, you'll not be able to join the uh, live chat. So make sure you guys subscribe and join the live chat. Say hello. Obviously, everyone's welcome here. Even my people that like us, people that hate us, everyone welcome here. You're only going to get love from here, no hate. So make sure you subscribe. Make sure you come out. Make sure you say hi. I know a lot of people watching. I even know them personally that are watching, but they're ne not going to say hi. So those who are not going to say hi, hi to all of you. Make sure you say hi back. 
Okay, right. Um, Anthony's saying, I am a Marvel fan. Oh, fair play with uh, the TV cam. It's uh, good to be LG or Sony, I think. No, nah, I can't be Sony. I can't. It's not that I can't afford it, but I don't want to spend that much. Do you know what I mean? It's, it's, it's way too much. That's why I think about the watches as well. Like, if I ever become a millionaire, I wouldn't buy a expensive watch, if it makes sense. You know, some people, they do buy a watch for like 200000 300000 No, I'm not that kind of guy. But yes, I want decent quality, but for a cheaper price as well. So that's why it's... Anyway, as I'm saying, my uh, car's VPF got plug. It cost me 150 to clean it. Yeah. It, make sure you clean it, though. You know, if you tell the mechanic to clean it, what they do, they do a regen. They delete the code and everything, and that's it. Give it back to you. They don't even clean it. So make sure you tell them physically cut it off in the middle and clean it, and then do a region so that it clears out. Okay. Uh, Connie's saying, if you don't do at least one long journey weekly, it's not worth buying a diesel. There you go. DPF will cost you a fortune if it goes. That's true. That's true. That's true. Uh, Connie's saying, uh, 2652, 14.79. Problem is, though, um, it's not just about long journeys. I mean, if you just go for a long journey for to give it a run, what happens on the with the modern cars? Because they got so many gears, you get on a on a one point six liter cars, you see nine gears. So you know they say drive uh, sixty mile an hour for fifty miles or te uh, well ten miles, fifteen miles. That's actually not going to help anymore because when you're at sixty mile an hour, you see your rev counter is below two, below probably in 1500 rpm and that's not actually clearing the dpf out so if you have that kind of issue if you have an automatic put it on third gear do the manual gear change and then go for 60 65 and then drive for certain miles and that would clear the dpf i don't think if you are uh, driving a car with only 1500 rpm and even if you go like 100 miles that's not really going to help as much as it's going to do when you put it on third gear and clear it out so basically your rpm needs to be over 3500 so with those modern cars over 3500 means you probably be going over 120 miles an hour so that's when you need to put it on lower gear and then drive it okay right too much technical information i know people find me boring nowadays so not many people watching that's the reason why right ahmed how's it going uh that's that's your coordinate right there which is 2537 um 1442 i should do actually a car uh, thing uh videos in it i do have a lot of knowledge about cars i'm not a mechanic obviously but because i've been selling cars for like just over 10 years 50, nearly 15 years really so mm. i've got that experience well, summer code. I think I took a summer's code name before, didn't I? No, he just mm -hmm. talked about the DPF. All right, then. Um, evening, Andrew. Cool. Evening, Father Steve. Andrew from Birmingham, from Dudley. I sold a car to a uh, Birmingham guy, a guy today. I was like, Do you know Andrew? BOTV winner. I said, No. <laughs> 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 Oh, and by the way, that's funny. Uh, first customer was from Birmingham. Second one is from uh, Lincoln. And he's from Gainsborough. And I was like, do you know Gar Darren Gutson? Uh, he won BOTV. So no. It was like, what's BOTV? I was like, oh, I forget about it. The guy from Birmingham didn't buy an app, did he? No, he bought a... <laughs> He bought a TT. He bought a TT. Oh, for me. nice one. Yeah. And the guy from uh, Gainsborough, he bought a Tuareg VW. Yeah, I like you know the, the picture, all these uh, caches, that's from that Gainsborough guy. Mm. <laughs> oh, man. Glad that you're doing well, buddy. Yeah, thank you, man. He's, he's, he's going great. Uh, the, the, the main issue at the moment is to source cars. Can't source it. I can't buy cars nowadays. The... the uh, what they are doing, like BCA, basically they bought all the cars off from the dealers before they used to be just the middlemen, and they uh -huh. bought all the cars off uh, cash from the dealers, and they're just storing it. So they're basically gonna just hoping to sell it for more. So I mean, so uh, you know the cars normally car price depreciates, but you know the car I used to sell for like about two years ago, I'm buying them for that price now. That is is crazy, man. The, how the price and everything gone up. Okay, Shama Purakau saying hi, Kamaul. All right, Kamarul. How's it going, Shama? Hope you're good. Shamna, Shamna. 
Okay. All right. Let's take Shamnas coordinate. How's it going, Shamnas? Did you smash that like button? Smash that like button, please. That's all it costs. That's all it costs to watch this stream. It's absolutely free. All you need to do, smash that like button. That's all you have to do. It doesn't cost you anything. Your bank balance will stay the same, exactly the same. It's not going to go up, by the way, but it's not going to go down either. So it's absolutely free. And click the bell button. Or click the bell icon next to it when you subscribe, all right? <laughs> <laughs> I feel sorry for my son because he's... Oh, yeah, like this video. He, he's so desperate to make videos for his channel. Uh, but uh, obviously, I don't have time for this. So, yeah, but I will be doing it soon. What's your what's the name of your channel? Give a shout out, Mahi. Come on. What's the name of your channel? Well with Mahi. Say that clearly. Grow with Mahi. So, grow with Mahi, yeah? That's, okay, no worries. Yes, Andrew, my man. How's it going? For Birmingham. Okay, right. Andrew. By the way, Andrew, dodgy cars from Birmingham. Every car that I bought from Birmingham always had problem. Not good. As long as you don't get them from Liverpool, because they've all been stolen. <laughs> 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 no offense, Father Steve. <laughs> How's it going, Father Steve? Lillian saying, uh, "Hi, my brother Cam. This." The coordinate. Thank you, my brother. Uh, let's take your coordinate, which is 2599. 2599.1340. Shall I tell my customer to subscribe my channel so that they can get, get discount? <laughs> <laughs> okay. <clears throat> Shamna saying, Dear Cam. Okay. That's my coordinate. I took your coordinate, Shamna. Thank you so much. Um, Andrew saying, Black Country versus Yum Yum Land. <laughs> Okay, next one. Invite for Father Steve to go to again. What the hell? Is that it has to be Abu? That has to be Abu. It's be, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, yeah. I haven't seen Lily Lily Rose hasn't been on for a while. Yeah, the both okay. went, Yeah, they're probably on honeymoon or something. Uh, <clears throat> what it is that a lot of people stop playing the OTB OTB Dean. That's the thing. Yeah, they have stopped playing BOTB, but they need to do a few more super car weeks so that people can come back. Mm. Okay, um, Doug is saying check out Hobbs and Parker auction. I uh, can't, I only go uh BCA, um, they don't really go any other auctions, but yes, I will do check out. Don't worry, it's just, just that because that's a big company, first of all, so many cars, and then I can buy cars with the AA inspection report. Well, it's not AA anymore, but it's BCA should certificate. So if something goes major goes wrong, you can give it back or they, they will pay for the repair. Normally don't get that from auctions. That's the only reason I go there, even though I pay so much extra for the cars. But yeah, what can I do? Al Kesh Patel. There you go. It has to be yeah, yeah. coordinate 252543 five, and then one four three two he's always like one two three four five six seven kind of coordinate all right so four three one four fourteen thirty two uh andrew saying uh but from uh sawbridge then come okay uh oh buy cars okay buy cars from service where is it well is that the name of the auction or the area because I normally go to Walsall and then uh, Wolverhampton. Those two auctions I try to avoid because cars are dodgy from there. Well, not all of them, <clears throat> but most of them. Never had a good luck. Uh, Connie saying, and don't buy cars from Bradford. Oh, yeah. Well, it's a bit too far from me. Now, I'm not talking about I'm not talking about uh, private buying, Connie. It's just the auction. So there's no auction in Bradford, but there is in, I think, Leeds, Manchester, uh, Wolverhampton, there's one in Scotland that way, and then uh, uh, Livingstone and everything, and then there's obviously you got this side, our closest one is Nottingham and Misham and everything, so that's where I go well, I don't go, but I buy, it, buy them online okay uh, right, next one uh, Shamna Purakal saying with that, without Romaldo our show not complete true, 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 true We'll put uh, Romaldo's, uh, when Romaldo's not in, normally I'm planning to put a picture in the background so that you can uh, see his picture and 
<laughs> it's gonna be complete. All right, guys, super chat from Andrew. Super chat. Uh, from Andrew. Uh, <laughs> it's not the same without Pike, is it? Doing that, <laughs> <laughs> I can I can actually add that now. I'm not with that stupid Apple anymore. So mm. obviously, if I if I was streaming because because I invite guests, that's why I do from streaming. If I was mm. from OBS, then I would have done a lot of things. Like that would have been like a dog coming from nowhere and barking and saying, Oh, super chat, super chat, and all of that. So, uh, <laughs> we've been doing it, those are not single ones, but yeah, there you go. Thank you so much, Andrew, my man. You are the top man. Thank you so much for the super chat. I really yes, appreciate man. that. And love, up, love you, Cam. Uh, big up the Leicester Massive. Uh, big up the Leicester Massive. So, uh, is a nice area, is it? amazing thank you so much mm. i didn't have to do that brother you didn't have to do that but thank you so much really appreciate that mm. okay right next one uh father steve's coordinator okay must be very old coordinator that is uh what was it uh 20 <laughs> joking uh 2581 uh 1151 okay 1151 are you on tomorrow as well cam yes yes tomorrow yeah. is the main day in it so okay. tomorrow we'll go early tomorrow we're gonna go early okay. so today uh, it's just that i was i was trying to put my uh, dslr i was trying to use my dslr as a webcam then i i did set it up and everything and it was overheating so i thought nah just stick to this old uh, my trusty webcams that i'm doing live stream from last couple of years well, hopefully hopefully we can get the whole crew on yeah, hopefully if they're free, yeah, they'll join. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Have you heard anything from Paul? I haven't heard or seen him for ages. Yeah, I mean, I've been, I've been you know, when he won and everything, uh, that's when I uh, messaged him privately. I didn't want to disturb him because I know he's very busy. He opened up his own business and everything. Mm. And uh, I messaged him that he, he actually won twice the giveaway. So mm. last week, well, the week before last week, he won. And then... Two weeks before, he won another twenty pounds. So he said, "Okay, give uh, my winning to Romaldo, please, and uh, so that he can buy loads of Yaris tickets." <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> so <laughs> I did uh, send it to Romaldo after. So that's yeah. when I spoke to him last. Uh, but he's very busy. He said he will come down on uh, Sunday nights, but I don't know. He didn't join since then. So yeah, I would message him see if he's uh, free and everything. So yeah. Yeah. yeah, it's nice to have a bit of banter and stuff. Yeah, of course. Yeah. And uh, Andrew with his uh, comical timing Thing, of the, uh, the fight. Pike would have came, but he's uh, he stopped playing BOTB. Uh, a lot mm. of people actually stopped playing BOTB. That's the reason they don't come. Like uh, my man, um, you know, the older other ones like uh, Mike, Mike, uh, Mitya, <laughs> and others. They all stopped playing BOTB. Mm. Andrew saying, "Need to get the ball rolling, Cam. Hope your channel is worth the support. Smash the like button." to and support cam the man hassan thank you so much really appreciate that brother okay any more coordinates guys i'm gonna do the average and everything now so if you've got any more coordinates please submit it now otherwise i'm gonna do the average did you want the average from the first one that you've done uh we need we'll take that in a minute because i will compare that to both averages tonight. okay so now we're... do that first um i'll not be able to put the thing on What's he called the target because I don't have Photoshop in this computer yet. I did, haven't downloaded it yet. It's mm. my new computer, so uh, I'll put that on in a bit. Okay, Mohammed just joined. How's it going, Mohammed? Hope you're good. He's another trader friend. Uh, so Mohammed's code is 2720 1265. 2720 1265. So it's 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 actually a decent cl cluster. I mean, definitely a lot better than uh, the first uh, streams. Uh, spread out and cluster obviously because uh, that there was it wasn't all over the place but it was quite you know far apart like everyone uh, so this obviously looks like a bit tight class tight tighter cluster than the last one so not bad mm. okay so let's do the height well that's the height and then let's do the um, the x Okay, so let's put a coordinate right there. Let's see what coordinate is that. The average coordinate where well, obviously no one wins. One of you were very close to the average, which is 2569-1409. All right, let me just put that in here. Uh, MD Hakim, I think I put your coordinate. Oh, my free ticket. Okay, I didn't. Okay, no problem. I put that on now, MD Hakim. Um, all right, let me just post it first and then I'll put your coordinate. All right.
Is that too loud, that noise, uh, being that clicking? No, it's all right. It's... But you can still hear it, innit? Yeah, I can still hear it, but it's all right. It's no orange. Okay. Then. Because the gaming uh, keyboard, you see, it's like the buttons are very, very higher up. Like, you have to press it, like proper press it. Okay, right. So, MDI Games coordinate, which is 2507, 13 to 21. 2507 It's good to see that where people go in after a week, if you know what I mean. So that's the reason why of uh, doing this live since today. That obviously we've done the first live stream on Tuesday, and then people everyone had a bit of a time to uh have a look at this picture and come up with the better coordinate so that you can see the cluster now so it is a lot tighter cluster than uh than before now it's, it's like two different clusters i understand but they're both coming from basically some of you are going to that post a bit higher and then there is another group of you uh, are going slightly lower so both kind of make sense now it's all about all it's all going to depend on matt now because I think the judges will go like that as well. There's going to be one cluster. A few, few of them going to go at the top. A few of them going to go at the bottom. So which cluster Matt is going to take off or everyone's going to agree to that, that's what it depends. Because mm. um, that's where it's going to depend. As in, if they take the bottom ones off and if there's more people when to the top, then he is going to be on that goal post. And then if there's only a few people went and then Matt takes everyone off, then he's going to go down by quite a lot. So it's going to be in the middle. So it's definitely, I believe, I'm almost 90% sure that the winning coordinate is going to be in between them two cluster here. Uh, uh, or on one of those cluster, or might just be in the middle. Mm. If they do a good judging, it's going to be in the middle. I'm just being honest with you guys. I mean, I don't mean to disappoint anyone, but that's what I'm thinking. Based on, even though I don't spend much time to play, for myself, like when I play, I don't spend much time, but I do spend time on, as in, especially when I suggest, I don't really suggest, but when I when I talk about these things, what are you doing? Sorry, guys. Okay, so uh, if they do a good judging, it's going to be in the middle, and either otherwise it's going to be either the, at the bottom or the top cluster. And this is the rough idea. As you can see, if you just cover this, uh, for example, with a different uh, color, uh, maybe, so this is the most left, which makes sense, perfect sense. And uh, the most right is this. Uh, I think it's a bit more too much. If I just keep that code no, and keep it there, I'm... so it's it's going to be around this area. Now, now the high is the issue Play. here. I Dean, I think you got an echo. You're probably playing this yeah. somewhere else. When I... Um... I talk about these things. Okay. As you can see. You're right, Dean. I think you're playing this uh, somewhere else. Is you know the Perfect video. Sense. If you could, if you could uh, turn the volume down on that one, please. You know, on the TV or a laptop or something. No. Okay. Right. So uh, this is it. As you can see. Um... Got it on the laptop. I haven't got any other okay. else. Sorry, guys. Sorry, Dean. That was me. <laughs> <laughs> because because I'm wearing a headphone. Do you know what I mean? It's I couldn't. I thought it's coming from there, but it's actually me. Did you hear an echo? No, I didn't hear anything. No. No, that's because it wasn't my headphone in it. So I was hearing my own thing. Okay. Yeah. Anyway, okay. So yeah, this is the spread. As you can see, if I do it from the other guy here. Um, mm. Okay, let me just do it. I'll be very surprised if somebody gets the exact coordinates for the winning one, though, on this. They might do, you know. I mean, reason I'm saying that, because because there is an offer every day, and people are going to be playing a lot of ticket, even though they're not actually saving so much. They are mm. going to be playing so many tickets, and there is going to be a lot of coordinates. The whole, this bit is going to be red in the BOTV system, like covered. Mm. red or yellow whatever color that is going to be uh so uh that's where i think that it might just be completely mad and they'll probably have a couple of people matching the winning coordinates well so if you are playing then you can go ahead and 
uh, make sure don't leave too much gap in between coordinates because uh, if you can get that exact coordinate, you it's going to be a, there's going to be a good chance of you matching that winning coordinate with someone else. And mm. obviously, if you don't win that, that's, that's heartbreaking. Do you know what I mean? Okay, right. So this is it. As you can see, uh, the, the, the rectangular square or whatever that is, uh, it should be inside that. And that looks like a good area to go for. Now, the ball could be anywhere in between these uh, four dots, as you can see. Uh, so, uh, yeah, good luck, guys. Let's see how it goes. Now, I'm going to take all of these coordinates off. And then um, I just uh, compare these two coordinates with uh, like the last week's coordinate and this week's coordinate and everything mm. just to see uh, how close we're in. Have we done any better? Did mm. we come up with a better coordinate or have done worse? Let's let's find out. Even though I haven't done a calculated average today, uh, but still it's not bad. That's where it's roughly going to be anyway. We don't suggest any coordinates anyway, so there's no point of doing the exact calculated average. Mm -hmm. So today's coordinate that we came up with, which is 2569, uh, 2569, 1409. And I've, I've got the one from previous. Okay, that. And then what's the previous one, Dean? It was 2530. All right, fourteen fifty three. Oh shit, it's close. Not bad. So twenty five thirty. Yep, fourteen fifty three. Okay, so these are the two coordinates. So what we did uh, today, we moved a bit to the right and slightly went higher. Which makes perfect sense, to be honest. And I'm, I'm liking these two coordinates. And it might just be in between these two coordinates. So it might just because X almost, I'm sure it's going to be that kind of X anyway. So uh, at least let's get one thing sorted. Uh, obviously, people got different opinion with the heights. So uh, if we just draw some lines uh, from these two players. I mean, this player. Uh, we Obviously, we're going to go the X from him. Because he's the one that looking at the ball. So this is our X sorted. Now the height. So like I mentioned, if we just draw a middle line from there. Let's pick a different color. Actually, no. Let's red. pick red. Red? Yes. Okay. Yes, okay. <laughs> okay. So uh, there you, you go. That's down. the middle. Down, my you, man. Here you go. I'll do. Your mate came to, uh, and bought a car from me, Darren, and he do he doesn't know about you. I told asked him. Uh, he he's from Gainsborough. I said, uh, "Do you know Darren Gutson? He won BOTB uh, and everything." He was like, "Oh, is that the that paid actor?" Oh, no, 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 I don't know him. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, yeah, that's what he said. Uh, anyway, so <clears throat> if you like to, if you're confused about the height, like I said, like I told you before, as I mentioned, that Darren did the same thing when he won. Uh, he basically drew like two uh, lines going up like that so you can also do that uh, if you are you know not sure uh, about the height so you can just do that instead do you know what I mean I mean I don't have to just don't just listen to me guys do your own thing but just I'm just suggesting like you can cover like that so that at least you can have a good chances now if you think oh the highest could be uh, probably to that middle of the pole just go up to there and if you think you know that the lowest could be as low as that so go up to there so you know like darren did like three lines two lines so you can also do that or you can do your own thing and if you're 100 percent sure that's where the ball should be just go for it i mean it's entirely up to you all right so i hope this video helped you guys uh and uh hope you liked this video if you did smash that like button and Fingers crossed. Hope you guys win and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Maybe 9 o'clock or even early. So, excuse me. And I will obviously uh, schedule the live streams before I go live anyway. So, thank you so much, guys, for watching. Th Dean, thank you so much for joining. No worries, buddy. Nice to see you. And Andrew, thanks again for the super chat. Really, really, really appreciate that, brother. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. And Take care. Have a good night, guys. Take care. Bye-bye. Good luck. God bless.